we use we've used all of the same methods but in completely different percentages so we've hardly <laughs> the all-party parliamentary group has not been called on very often and not done that much proactively to achieve yeah. a particular outcome and it did a hell of a lot this time and was extremely welcome and we wouldn't have achieved the result we did without it i don't think um and the good news is it's made us kind of a bit more you know match fit if you like and we've had to look at all routes to lobbying and we haven't been able to rely on the two traditional ones which are sort of government to government so we haven't been able to go directly into defra and we haven't been able to go directly into uh, the european commission in brussels with committee of that we've had to do it a different way and, and actually media coverage has been very important for that i mean the, the, the i don't think in my you know eight years at the wsga you know I mean, I would never have predicted VI ones, which are a thing. It's a bit like you know, new words: Brexit, furlough, coronavirus. You've never heard of VI ones actually, if you're anywhere outside the industry, even sometimes in the industry until recently. That has been by far the most um, reported on wine issue that we've been able to get into the media. I mean, every title, you know, particularly um, you know, national newspapers. I mean, you know, the FT producing a, a full page on VI ones is pretty extraordinary. Uh, so, you know, th that's shown to be quite effective, and it, it probably is particularly when bandwidth with government is narrow. Uh, 